feeling that warmth penetrate deeper and deeper <laughs> till I think I'm going to burst then whoosh. So, uh, I hear your uh, fiancé is well-to-do. Very. You're gonna eat that fat? <laughs> so, uh, marrying money can have its perils. 10 or 15 years down the line, after you've adapted to a lifestyle now totally beyond your means, you can find yourself cast aside a hollow husk, penniless and crushed. <laughs> now, as Big Willie's 85, he's on his third pacemaker. Oh, muzzle tough. <laughs> Out of curiosity, did this guy ever see you eat? After dinner is the time I need a cigarette most. As long as I don't stop eating, I'll be fine. Well, this is very good, Dee. You're already identifying those moments that trigger your worst cravings. Yeah, yeah. No, no, really. Perhaps it would help to know that you're not alone. Dad is an ex-smoker. Dad, can't you tell us about when you crave a cigarette most? Ah, uh, when I had insomnia. Mm. I'd get up, pour a water glass full of bourbon, light a cigarette. Next thing you know, I couldn't keep my eyes open. Nothing relaxes you like a cigarette. <laughs> of course, it gives you a hell of a headache in the morning. Well, I smoked for years, but I never became addicted. To this day, I can buy a pack, have a cig or two, toss them in a drawer, and not crave another for months. You know, there's a word for people who can do that. What is it? Oh, yes. <laughs> There's no need to be insulting just because you're wrestling with an unhealthy and disgusting habit. It isn't disgusting, it's wonderful. Oh, now, Bebe, tell me, what is so wonderful about smoking? Everything. I like the way a fresh, firm pack feels in my hand. I like peeling away that little piece of cellophane and seeing a twinkle in the light. <laughs> I like coaxing that first sweet cylinder out of its hiding place and bringing it slowly up to my lips, striking a match, watching it burst into a perfect little flame and knowing that soon that flame will be inside me. <laughs> I love the first puff, pulling it into my lungs, little fingers of smoke filling me, caressing me. Feeling that warmth penetrate deeper and deeper <laughs> till I think I'm going to burst then whoosh. <laughs> Watching it flow out of me in a lovely, sinuous cloud. No two ever quite the same. 